lovely gathering and thank you all for coming. Thanks to everybody who's helped make this evening possible. Sandy and Jim who are co-hosting this event with me and Jeremy. To our Ferocious makers, Barbara Moore and Ellen Barron. Yeah. We're here to celebrate the holiday of Passover or Pesach in Hebrew. The holiday of Passover celebrates the exodus of the Jews from Egypt after they were enslaved by Pharaoh. And in the celebration, we use a very specific order of events for the evening. In fact, the word Seder, translated into English, is in fact order. There are specific things that constitute a Seder, and we'll hear about all of those as we go forward. We light and bless the holiday candles. Thank you, God, for the festival lights and for bringing our family and friends together to celebrate Pesach. different from all other nights of the year. On all other nights we eat all kinds of bread and crackers. Why do we only eat matzah and Pesach? <laughs> On all other nights we eat many kinds of vegetables and herbs. Why do we eat bitter herbs? Mara or at our cedar. Baruch, Baruch at Adonai. Yeah, that. Celery, parsley, baror, which is the um, horseradish, haroset, which is symbolic of the mortar that was used to help bricks together because the Jews built the pyramid. Sometimes it's a lamb's shank, and this is a chicken neck. So uh, there was a rabbi that said, a woman would be a rabbi when there's an orange on the Seder plate. And that's where that came from. Dinner is served, but we're going to do one song. I'm going to ask Mal to use his drum on this one. Yesterday, Mike and I discussed how my story relates to the Passover story. He told me how the Jews were enslaved by the Egyptians and how Moses, with the faithful God, liberated them. To me, I feel that I have too been enslaved by racism and prejudice and injustice in our criminal justice system. I am hopeful that with the direction I am taking and my choices in my life that I will experience a sort of freedom as well. I, I know I have a good future in front of me and with a good job and the support of family and friends and God that I could be a success. Yes, I have more challenges in front of me and with all I learned, I am confident that my future is bright. Thank you.
story that Elijah, a great teacher who lived many years ago, visit every city to wish everyone a, everyone a year of peace and freedom. We open the door and invite Elijah to come. Watch his cup to see if any of the wine disappears. And let us sing a song walking. Next year. Yeah.